to the video. Today we're gonna to talk about some of the best supplements that you guys can use to keep making gains, to make, um, to, to just maximize your muscle growth in general. Um, and this comes, the, the idea behind this video comes because I went to GNC yesterday to pick up some Rocky Road Quest Bars, which um, by the way are really, really good. So if you guys haven't tried the Rocky Road Quest Bars, I highly recommend them, they're delicious. But I walked into GNC, I went to get the Rocky Road Quest Bars and you know, they, they they, they tried selling me some stuff that, you know, obviously doesn't work and the average gym goer or the average person that's just starting lifting or just anything in general that comes with fitness that they would believe, right? So they tried selling me some stuff and obviously I was just like, no, I just want this. Um, that's all I came for. But um, as I was there in the line, there was this kid. He looked like he was probably like 16, 17 years old coming out with like a whole bunch of things and I was right behind them in line so I saw him pay I seen um, everything the, the, the GNC employee told him and he just left with so many things that were really really unnecessary and the GNC people you know they were it was two in the cash register and they were fighting in between them um, you know telling one one another no this was my sale and then the other one was like no this was my sale I saw him first this and that and keep in mind the kid that bought all these things was leaving with everything GNC brand you know it's really annoying that this happens in the fitness industry because there's just so many people that don't know that don't know any better when they're first starting and and this is one of the biggest reasons why I started the channel because I went through so much trial and error I bought so many supplements that I did not need I could have saved so much money and um, just seeing that in person gets me mad. Um, I obviously didn't say anything because I didn't. I didn't want to start any problems or you know just. I didn't. I, I'm just not like that. So, um, but it just got to me. It really got to me. So I thought I'd make a video on it. So the whole point behind this video is to just tell you guys how I felt um, when I saw that happen. The kid left GNC. He looked. He looked really happy leaving GNC with all this stuff that he did not need. This video is basically to reach out and. Hopefully a lot of people see this so that they can know what to buy when they walk into GNC, um, what works, what doesn't work. I see so many people buying things that are so unnecessary. Um, they go into GNC and buy things that are really, really unnecessary because they see them in magazines, they see them on YouTube, people on YouTube promote these products because they're getting paid for it and it's just really annoying. So for the things that work, creatine, protein powder. Um, BCAs is something that is like a 50-50. If you have the money for it, you can go ahead and buy it. If you don't, then don't waste your money on it. It's not gonna make that big of a difference. Fish oils, um, fish oils, a multivitamin, and in my opinion, this is what I take, uh, vitamin C pills. That's what I think you guys need. Um, vitamin C pills, you probably don't even need if you if if you can just get that multivitamin and just take one a day, and that's you'll be good to go. Protein powder is, is something that's used as convenience. If you can't get all your protein from whole food, then yes, you can go ahead and have a protein shake. But keep this in mind, it is not necessary for you to have a protein shake um, after, you, after your workout session, 30 minutes after your workout session. It is not necessary. You can get all your protein from whole food sources. So keep that in mind, guys. Protein powder isn't necessary. So if you don't have the money for protein powder, just make sure you're getting all your protein from whole foods. Creatine has been something that has been tested so many times and there's so many tests on, on, on the internet that you guys can look up and it's been proven to work so um, creatine is something that I would highly recommend. Fish oils is something that I would also highly recommend especially if you're lifting heavy um, to keep those joints lubricated and keep everything nice and smooth so that you can avoid injury and, and, and avoid joint pain. Um, while you're lifting. Now all these other supplements like CLAs and like glutamine and, and yohimbine I don't know. There's just so many things. Um, fat burners. Fat burners for example. You guys, all these stuff that, that you read online and read on magazines that are going to burn more fat, accelerate muscle fat, um, spot reduce fat. Let's say you want to lose belly fat. Um, there's products that I see online on, on G at GNC that promote this type of thing that is going to spot reduce body fat. That is impossible guys, your body determines where it loses fat first and where it loses fat last. So um, fat burners and all that stuff, um, honestly I don't really, you know, I, I don't think they work. A fat burner, you can take it before workout and it will give you more energy, especially if you've been cutting for a while. And 
then a fat burner might work, but it's the same thing as taking pre-workout. It's it's the same thing, guys. So um no, there's no magic pill, there's no magic anything to make muscle gains or to burn fat. So don't believe that guys. But yeah, it was just a really quick video, I guess like a rant and, and, and informative video for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave it a like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.